We're in Microsoft Windows 10. I'm going to show you how to create a countdown timer. Now, a countdown timer can be used for a lot of great things, such as maybe counting down for cooking or for some activity that you're doing. Uh, so lots of different reasons to have a countdown timer. Maybe even a scientific experiment. Uh, so in the lower left-hand corner, click on the Start button and choose Alarms and Clock. And if you don't, if you don't see it selected by default, just click on the Timer button. All right, so by default, we see here it's set for 15 minutes and 30 seconds. And if we want, we can just go ahead and choose that default, and you can see it's counting down from there. If we can, want, we can pause, we can restart. And if we want, we can uh, restart it back from the original time just by clicking that button. If we click this button on the right, that's the Expand button. It makes it nice and big, so it's easy to see. And you can click it again, and it goes back. Another nice feature is if you click the plus sign, you can say uh, second timer for something else. You can say, I don't need it 15 minutes, I just need it for one minute. Or actually, in this case, one hour. We'll do one hour, and there we go, four. Okay, so let's go ahead and click save, and now we see two timers on here. And again, you can Expand those if you want. You can scroll back and forth if you want. Start them. They don't have to be started at the same time, which is really nice. There you can see all the timers at once. We'll reset that one. We'll reset that one. So that's how you set up uh, countdown timers in Microsoft Windows 10.